An estimated 46 million people are expected to fly during the holidays. But with the busy travel season comes a major policy change for TSA and its controversial Quiet Skies program. All right, so if you're not familiar with that program, it calls for marshals to follow and monitor anyone they identify as a person of interest based on behavior. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding joining us now live from Jacksonville's airport this morning. Ashley, what's changing? Well, Jen and Bruce, good morning. You know, they're still going to be paying attention, but if people aren't doing anything of note on a flight, they will no longer send out what is called an action report to intelligence agencies. But yes, behavior was the big thing they were paying attention to. Those behaviors include using a phone, going to the bathroom, talking with other people, or changing clothes. The program has been controversial and has raised questions about people possibly being targeted based on their nationality or race. But the TSA has defended the program. Now, analysts say the projected number of people who plan to fly between this Thursday and January 6th is up more than 5% from last year. Doing some math, that comes out to about 126,000 passengers a day. Now, the busiest travel days are expected to be this Thursday, Friday, and the day after Christmas. We spoke to Lorraine and Steve Cook, who say they're always ahead of the rush in the days leading up to Christmas. Yeah, we made, uh, we like to make plans early because the tickets are cheaper that way, and uh, just to, you know, I'm, I'm a planner. Always early, always early. Can't wait for the last minute. So you might be wondering, what are the easiest days to travel? No surprise here, they are Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, and also January 6th. Now, as always, if you're going to be flying out, you will want to check with your airline for your flight status. Reporting live this morning, Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station.